Hi, everybody. This is Peter Schiff from Europe Pacific Precious Metals, and I am holding in my hand the most innovative precious metals product that I've ever seen. This is called the Val Cambi Combi Bar, and it's manufactured by the Swiss refiner Val Cambi, and it's all the rage in Europe. It started in 2011, and it's just making its way to the United States. And it's kind of like a little chocolate bar. You know, the Swiss are known for their chocolate, except this isn't made of milk chocolate or dark chocolate. It's made of pure gold. And what makes it like a chocolate bar is it has these little tiny little squares that you can break off. The bar in it itself is 50 grams of 0.9999 fine gold, which is about 1.6 ounces. But you can break it up into 50 one gram bars and they're all identical and they're all marked now at today's price of gold about 1600 an ounce the melt value of this bar melt value is about twenty five hundred dollars and that means each individual one gram bar is worth about 50 bucks i can take this a bar gold, I could just put it here in my wallet with my other credit cards and I can close it up, put it in my pocket and I've got $2,500 in my wallet and I can spend as little as $50 worth at a time. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to demonstrate exactly how you go about breaking your Val Cambi combi bar. I'm going to break off one bar of five gram squares. And I'm just going to bend it a little bit. You can see how it bends this one bar. I want to try to just get one bar off. And there you go. So now I've separated it. Here is basically um, 45 grams of gold. And now this stick, this one little five gram stick, that's $250. This little strip right here all by itself is worth $250. Now, as you want to spend this little strip, what you can do is you can break it down further one at a time. So I'm just going to snap one off like so, bend it a little bit, and bend it again the other way. And now I've broken off one little chip. You can see in my hand just how small this, um, this little piece is. But it's still, I guess if you take a magnifying glass, you can see what it is, 0.999 pure one gram of gold. Here's a $50 Federal Reserve note. Today they both have the same purchasing power. Who knows what tomorrow holds, but I know that this little gram has real intrinsic value and it represents all the effort required to mine it. What about this 50? Nothing. The Fed runs them off the printing press. It doesn't cost much. It doesn't matter what number they put on the bill. Here's a $100 bill. There's no real difference between 100 and 50. They're the same size. It costs the same amount to make this bill as that bill. They require the same effort. But if I want 100 worth of gold, I need twice as much gold. What I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to break off another one of these little pieces. Right? I'm going to have to take this strip and I'm going to have to break it off like so. Boom. There we go. Now there's three left here. And now I've got two pieces. That's worth $100. Why is that worth $100? Because it's twice as much gold. You have to find twice as much. It takes twice the effort. This $100 bill is not worth twice that $50 bill. That's what we mean by saying intrinsic value. So when you have this, when you have these little strips, when you have this bar, you have real money. You have something with intrinsic value. You have something that must be mined. You don't have something that can be printed. The Fed could print all these they want. They can put as many zeros as they want. They could put a trillion. They can have a trillion dollar bill. It won't matter. But they can't produce this. They can't tax this with inflation. This is real money. What can you do with this? I mean, you could basically fill up your car with gas. You can get a tank of gas. Some of you, if you have a big SUV, you might have to break off a second square. You might need two squares. But the point is, let's say there's a lot of inflation. Let's say at some point in the future, a few years from now, 
Maybe it costs $200, $300 to buy a tank of gas. I bet during that environment, you can still fill up your car with one of these babies. Now, maybe the gas station owner, maybe he doesn't want more paper. He wants something that retains its value. Maybe he would prefer to be paid in real money, in gold, than funny money, than fiat money. In fact, maybe there'll be a long line for gas if all you got is paper money, but maybe you go to the head of the line. Maybe there's a separate pump if you've actually got one of these. And it might apply for all sorts of things. You can take these to the supermarket. You can barter them individually. And remember, Euro-Pacific precious metals, we're selling these Valcambi combi bars at a lower price than you can find anywhere in the United States. Depending on how many bars you buy, and I recommend that you load up on them, we're going to charge anywhere from 6.95% to 7.85% over the spot price of gold. And that includes the commission that we charge to sell you the bar. If you want to get more information on these bars, contact your precious metal specialist at my gold company, Euro Pacific Precious Metals. You can also just go to shiftgold.com, my last name, S-C-H-I-F-F, gold.com. That'll take you directly to the Euro Pacific Precious Metals website. That's all for now.